Hi, there's something I want to tell you. You'll never guess what it is. So I'll just come straight out with it. There's a dragon living inside of me. Yep, that's right, a dragon. Even as a name, it's Faba. Faba the dragon. Faba has been living with me ever since I was born. But you know what? I didn't even know. I've only just found out about him. Because even though Faba's a good dragon and doesn't mean any harm, he's also just a little bit mischievous and lazy. How? Well, we all have cells in our body, right? Cells are those tiny little things you can only see under a microscope. We're all made up of cells, lots and lots of them. Cells make up our hair and skin and muscle and blood and nerves. They make sure our body works properly. Let me show you. This is what a regular cell looks like. And here's what mine look like. See how they're different? Well, that's because Faber the Dragon sits inside some of my cells and changes their shape. A bit like when we make wobbly shapes with Play Potty. You see, Fab is meant to help my cells take out the rubbish my body doesn't need. But he's lazy. He just sits there so the rubbish builds up instead. No matter how many times I tell Faber to clean up, he just won't listen. So guess what? Because Faber won't do his chores, I now get a little bit sick sometimes. I get these pains in my feet and in my hands, so Mum and Dad took me to the doctor and they gave me some medicine. I take it in the morning and again at night. You know what? It really helps me. The other problem is my sweat glands. Did you know about those? But when the body sweats, it comes through these little openings on the skin called glands. The sweat sits on the skin and helps our body to cool. But guess what? My sweat glands get clogged up too when Faber leaves his rubbish lying around. So whenever it gets really hot, so do I. Maybe you'll see me outside sometimes with a really red face and I'll tell you I'm not feeling so well. Well, when that happens, you'll know it's time to give me a cold drink and a cold cloth and take me inside. Another thing that happens to me sometimes is that my tummy really hurts and makes me want to cry. That just means mischievous Faber is up to his old tricks again. Not to worry, there isn't anything we can do about it. Just give me a hug and tell me I'll be okay. Sometimes when this happens, I just want my mum and dad. But you know what? I'm slowly getting used to living with Faber inside of me. I know I'll keep asking him to clean up and I know he'll just be too lazy to do it. But there's no way he's going to stop me from being a regular kid. It just means I have to see the doctor more than my friends. That's okay. My doctor's really nice. So now you know all about Fab and me, I just wanted to tell you my story to let you know what is happening to me when sometimes I'm not feeling too well. It's because of Fab the Dragon.